Hello, this is Joseph from Gorilla3D. In this tutorial, we'll be learning the basics of generating a cloud from an array. Um, basically, a cloud is tags that get bigger and smaller, like a cloud would, and is based on the frequency of that keyword or tag that you want to call it. So, right now, I have, I have just a set of keywords from an array. And also have a, a blank array called tags. We're going to go through the keywords, split them up by spaces, and then add them to the tag array. So let's go ahead and create our first loop, which is in a for each, and add the, the variable keywords as keyword. And let's go ahead and add another for each loop for what we're going to do next. Okay. So now what we're going to do next is explode, I mean, or split, explode and split. So let's go ahead and make a new variable wor words equals explode. And explode them by spaces, so we have a space there in quotations. And let's add keyword. All right, and now we have an array of of words and words that are split up by spaces. So now we're going to go through each word. So words as word, and we're going to check if this word is already in our variable tags. So if we're going to create an if statement, use the function is set. So it checks if this specific um, key keyword in tags is already set. So then we add in the word variable, the variable word. So basically if the word is in this tag, we are going to add it. So tag again. Uh, forgot the S here. Word. Now it's going to be plus equals one. That's if it's already set. If it's not existing, so we do else. We are going to go ahead and create it. So tags. Word equals one. The reason why I'm using one and plus equals one is because it's just going to count the frequency of the word. Um, so now our basic, this is, we just generated our cloud. So if we do print r and then we do the variable tags and we go ahead and upload it to the server we get a simple printout of hello, which is presented four times. World is presented one time. And then we have world with the lowercase presented one time. Now the problem here is world and world are the same, but there's lowercase and higher case. To fix that, we can go back to where or for each of the words are is and we say word equals str to lower which basically makes all the words in our lowercase and we say we want to make word all lowercase so we have word equals lowercase word and we go ahead and save it refresh and as you can see now hello is four is all lowercase and world is there two times all right so now we have our basic cloud set up but we need to present it so we're going to present in HTML we're going to do yet another for each loop and put in tags as and we're going to do tag equals um, then the greater than sign and we're going to put size all this is basically saying is our keyword which is our tag equals is um, is going to have the value of size which is going to be our, our actual font size. So let's go ahead and echo span. 
span. So we have the tag span here, and we put tag. This is going to echo all of our, our tags. Let's put space there just in case. So now we now we have all our tags just as there. And we want to add sizing, so let's go back to our span tag and put style equals font size. And the forward slash, since we're already using double quotes already. And then we put parentheses size and then px so then we're going to save it and refresh again and now we have sizing which is really really small so let's add a default size to start with so we put size plus equals seven so it's going to be at least seven fonts or seven pixels big or higher and as you can see now we have hello world world again and they all have their different sizes um now if you notice here they're not in alphabetical order and the problem with that is what if you actually want to look for a tag and you can't find it because it's not in alphabetical order it's nice that you have the sizes but you also want to have the order so for the for loop that we start to present our tags we're going to use uh, a php um, sorting function which is called a case sort all that does is sort by the keyword so we do tag K sort tags and that's all you do in it source it by the keyword and now we have again drawing world now if you want to reverse the order you can put kr uh, and it reverses the order so there's k sort and there's kr sort I like to keep it with the a's first so I'm going to keep it with k sort and there is there is our basic cloud